Hi, Chuck Hawley from West Marine. You know, a critical part of any navigator's inventory is to have a quality hand bearing compass. This is a particularly nice one. This is the Iris 50 from Plastimo. Now, this is typical of what we've generally talked about as hockey puck compasses, because it's about the size and shape of a hockey puck. This makes it extremely easy to wear around your neck. And you know, a hand bearing compass isn't something you want to store down below. You want it available for instant use. The way this works is, you know, in traditional hand bearing compasses, you hold something in your hand at a long distance and you sort of have to align your head and the two veins on it and look at the compass and focus your eyes on the horizon and then close and it's, it's actually really difficult. With a hockey puck style compass, it has what's called an infinity prism on the top of it. And what this allows you to do is to look at something on the horizon and instead of having to change the focus of your eyes, you actually see the bearing projected as if it were on the horizon so that you don't have to change the focus. So for example, I'm just going to look across the harbor here and I can see instantly that this, the mast on a sailboat over there bears about 131 degrees. And if I'm careful, I can actually read this to about a half a degree accuracy, or I should say a half a degree precision. Hand bearing compasses are very valuable when you're doing tactical racing on a sailboat. They're also good for navigation. If you can see known land objects, you can take a couple of sights on them and you can draw lines of position on a chart. In addition though, the thing that is probably the most useful is figuring out if you're going to collide with another vessel. You have to use the rule of constant bearings. And what this says is, if you're looking at another vessel that's going to cross your bow and the bearing between the two vessels doesn't change over time, it means you're going to collide with them. Otherwise, if the, vest, if the bearing is changing, you're going to pass behind them or they're going to pass behind you. So it's very good for avoiding collisions at sea. So the Plastimo Iris 50 is a great hand bearing compass. It uses the infinity prism, it's very accurate, and it's very rugged. And of course you can see it's very small, you can wear it around your neck. And of course, it's available from West Marine. <laughs>